One of the toughest types of recording scenarios is on location, especially if you are recording a podcast and you have the pressure of a guest waiting to record. So in this video, we're going to talk about several different ways you can use the iRig Stream Mic Pro to record on location podcast content. Hey, it's Felisa Zay, and I am a producer, musician, content creator, and I am here to show you how to use the iRig Stream Mic Pro to record high quality podcast content. As a podcaster, it's already difficult as it is to get into the whole audio production side of podcasting. You may have gotten into podcasting just because you wanted to share stories, because you want to share your unique perspective, and maybe you have zero background in audio production. But somehow, as you jump into the podcasting space, you are having to become an audio engineer. <laughs> what can become even more challenging is if you're podcasting on the go and you need to carry around all that equipment to record. Audio interfaces, computer, mic stands, microphones, maybe even multiple microphones if you have multiple guests. It can become really complicated really fast and become just a big hassle and time drain when you're trying to just get really quick content on the go. And even if you are an experienced audio engineer or have, you know, just a lot of background in audio production, on location podcasting can still be a real hassle with all the gear that you have to lug around. So that's why I want to talk about the iRig Stream Mic Pro. This is a really great piece of equipment for on location recording for many reasons. First of all, it's small. It's easy to pack, it's easy to set up. You just plug it into your computer or your phone directly or an iPad and you can just start recording. So it's compact size, it's portability, already makes it a great choice for on location recording. But let's talk about its big standout feature which is that it's a multi-pattern condenser microphone and interface all in one. So you don't have to go pack an interface. You don't have to pack multiple microphones. You can just bring this one mic and record your on location podcast content. How do you do that? Switch the microphone pattern. With four different microphone patterns, you can easily switch from cardioid, omnidirectional, bidirectional, and stereo. Here's how you switch between patterns. You click until you get to that blinking pattern right there. You see it? That is the cardioid pattern. Now, if you take the wheel and roll it over like that, now we're in omnidirectional. And then you roll it over again, and now we are in the bidirectional or figure eight pattern. And if we roll it over again, now it's green. That's the stereo pattern. And then if you click, now I've locked in that stereo pattern, and there you go. To go back again, it's blinking. If I move it again, now we're back in the cardioid pattern. Let's say I wanna do omnidirectional, click, boom, omnidirectional. So that's how it works. Very easy to switch between patterns. Now, why is this important? Well, with four different microphone patterns, you can easily switch from cardioid, omnidirectional, bidirectional, and stereo. This gives you flexibility. This ability to switch between different microphone pickup patterns allows you to record several different recording scenarios. So for instance, maybe you're commentating on the sidelines of a sporting event. You would just use that cardioid pattern to get a very direct front facing sound on the front of the mic, cardioid. Just getting that front area. So yeah, you would just use the cardioid pattern if you're just recording by yourself. Now, if you are recording multiple guests, maybe you're doing like a round table discussion, you might wanna use that omnidirectional pattern. You could set this microphone right in the middle of a table or wherever you're recording and put it into the omnidirectional pattern and be able to pick up everybody around the microphone. The pattern would now pick up sound all around it. Let's say that you have a one-on-one -on -one interview that you're doing and you're going to your guests house to record them on site and you just want to pick up your guest and yourself. This is where you would use that bi-directional pattern or they also call it a figure eight pattern where it's picking up the sound the front and the back not all around like the omnidirectional pattern just front and back. So if you're speaking right here into the microphone and your guest is on this side speaking into the microphone on this side now you're picking up your guest and yourself. 
perfect for a face-to-face interview. Now let's say that you do a concert review podcast or something of that sort, and you're recording on location content at a music concert, and you really wanna capture an immersive sound of the whole experience for your listeners. For this type of application, you would put the iRig Stream Mic Pro in stereo mode to get a more immersive sound and pick up all the ambient noises in the experience. So there you have it. If you really wanna have a hassle-free, easy, on location, quick mobile rig that you can quickly set up and capture podcast content or any type of audio content on location, the iRig Stream Mic Pro is a great option. All you need is the iRig Stream Mic Pro, your computer or a mobile device like an iPad or an iPhone with your favorite DAW and boom, you can just start recording your content on location. The setup takes less than 10 minutes and you are rocking and rolling. So let us know what kind of podcast content you're recording in the comments below. And if you'd like more detailed instructions, tutorials, and workflows on how to use the iRig Stream Mic Pro for podcasting, audio production, social audio, music production, go check out my Audio Files Toolkit. It is the complete solution for content creators of all types, from musicians to podcasters to live streamers. I will show you how to get the best sound for whatever content you're creating in my Audio Files Toolkit. You can check it out at the link in the description. And for tips on how to use the iRig Stream Mic Pro and other mobile gear in the iRig series, make sure to subscribe to this channel as well as my channel and go to the links in the description for more resources from Audio Files and IK Multimedia. Can't wait to see what you'll create.